Hello everyone, Alien Volt here, and I am playing Star Wars The Old Republic. And this is a video of your homestead. And because I'm a subscriber, I have early access to this, so I'm actually getting to see this content before a lot of other people. Oh, well, it looks like all my bars were reset. Um, that happens from time to time, especially when you don't log in for a while, so that's alright. Just have to get my mount another way. Or my speeder, rather. I used to call it an amount. World of Warcraft. You are a lot of years playing that game. <laughs> I guess I should have let that play. I wasn't thinking, I just skipped through it really quick. But basically what he was doing was selling, you know, a vacation retreat home. Okay, what you would normally do here is you would come over here to one of these locations and you would purchase the home that you needed. Like for this one is Cost City. Uh, it cost me 5,000 credits, which is really nothing. I mean, I've spent 80,000 credits repairing after a, a raid, so 5,000 credits is really dirt cheap. Pretty nice view of the Empire Capital City. Alright, just like my video on Coruscant, um, you get your package when you come here, and then of course you decorate it how you want to. Uh, on this video right here, I'm actually going to give you a tour of uh, the building. I'm not going to really cover the decorations or anything like that because I've already done that in the Coruscant video. So if you'd like to see how the homesteads are actually decorated, please watch that video. This one is just going to basically show you what it looks like when they're actually set up. So once you start unlocking different rooms and setting them up um, with different furniture, banks, vendors, stuff like that, um, as you can see my mailbox is there and for completing that quest not only did I get that um, those items to actually help decorate I actually got money as well so not a bad thing and actually it was uh, 4,000 something credits which was pretty much about as much as this place cost to actually open and unlock now with this one it's actually faction specific um, just like the Coruscant one is Republic specific but you can travel to your own um, homesteads of the opposite faction. You just have to pay a fee every time you want to do it. And I think it's somewhere around 5,000 credits. Which is probably steep if you have to do it every time. You want to do it a lot. If you don't want to really do it that often, like I said, 5,000 credits is nothing. But you don't want to be doing it back and forth all day long. This place is pretty extravagant. It gets pretty large once you start unlocking everything, which makes a really nice place to, you know, design, customize, and call your own. There's also the Narshada homestead, which I'll be covering in another video, but that one along with the Tatooine homestead are shared factions, so um, both characters from opposite factions can travel there without any type of penalty or fee to be smuggled in. Alright, well that's going to end this video. Please tune in for more and I'll see you next time.